So we've learned about what makes up wetlands and the different types of wetlands. But why do we care about wetlands anyway? Let's go back to Della and Rick and we're going to learn about the functions, functions of wetlands and why they are so incredibly important. This little wetland doesn't look like much. I'm not even sure why we're here. We're right next to an office building and surrounded by parking lots. So why is this wetland important? Good question, Della. The retention pond provides a great example of some functions of wetlands. Let's talk about them. First and foremost is water storage and groundwater recharge. When water comes off of that parking lot or that impervious surface that you were talking about, the water is stored here and released into the groundwater for ultimate release during trout or low water flows benefiting both people who use the water and the wildlife and fisheries that depend on it. Another example is improving water quality. Wetlands filter, remove, and store nutrients, sediments, and other pollutants. By improving the water quality, you're improving it for both wildlife and people. Wetlands also, by storing the water here, reduce the temperature, and thermal effects can be significant. The vegetation and the groundwater cools the temperature of the water so the water can be utilized for, again by both people and by wildlife. Perhaps one of the biggest examples of uses for a wetland, wetlands serve as nurseries. They provide critical habitat for thousands of species of aquatic and terrestrial plants and animals. Another example of a use of a wetland would be flood and shore protection. When rivers overflood or hurricanes strike coastal communities, wetlands help to absorb and slow floodwaters and, and also storm surges, providing protection for both people and property. Wetlands also provide recreational educational opportunities. Wetlands are great for recreating and learning, boating, photography, nature watch, and maybe just enjoying some quiet time once in a while. All these uses result in economic benefit to people. The cost to communities to provide these different functions in the absence of a wetland would be astronomical. I did not realize that wetlands are so important for, in so many ways for people and wildlife. Back to you in Canada. Thanks for that great explanation about the functions of wetlands out there on the East Coast.